Good morning, and we are in the second generation Volkswagen E-Up right now. Today, going to do a pretty long trip all the way from Antwerp in Belgium to Zurich in Switzerland. We're going to attempt to do that. It's about 800 kilometers or so, and uh, it's going to be an interesting trip because today is going to be a very hot day. At the moment, as you can see, it's 20.5 degrees Celsius outside. It's morning at 8.47. This here is the information of the battery. So as you can see, it's 23 degrees right now, the battery, and it's charged to 80%. And uh, we are using the OBD adapter port right here uh, to get the data straight from the battery. And we'll just fast charge today, drive and see how the battery is doing because today it's going to be about 35 degrees or so outside and the battery is going to heat up and it's going to slow the charge. So we'll see how it goes. Okay, so after having driven 163 kilometers, we're now at Ionity in Belgium, and we arrived with a range of about 33 kilometers. As you can see, it's already nearly empty. And here is the information on the battery. As you can see, battery temperature went up. It's now 27.28 degrees Celsius, but it's gonna go up rapidly as we're charging, and we're getting a charge rate of uh, 35 kilowatts. So that's pretty nice. And um, yeah, we're gonna charge here for a bit and then head onwards. Okay, so we've been here charging at Ionity in Belgium for now 40 minutes, as you can see here. We're still getting 20.3 kilo, uh, sorry, 21 kilowatts, um, and we're nearly at 80%, but we're going to get going now. And we're going to look inside the car and check what is going on here. So, as you can see, 80% nearly, um, range of 197 kilometers. And look at this, as the battery went up nice and hot, it's now at 39 degrees Celsius. And uh, like it said on the charger, about 20 kilowatts still. Yep, so let's head off now and uh, continue. Next stop is another charger. Okay, we have arrived at our next stop. Um, we are now as you can see, relatively empty again after having driven another one and a half hours. The battery temperature, I don't know if you can see it good or not, but yeah, it's at uh, yeah nearly 40 degrees Celsius. I need to take this away otherwise it doesn't focus. Yeah, 40 degrees Celsius, I can see on the top there, we're charging at 26 kilowatts, which is pretty nice. And uh, we're gonna stay here for a bit and um, get something to eat. But my prediction is when the battery temperature reaches about 45 degrees Celsius. This charging speed is gonna go down drastically, but we'll see, we'll see. All right, all right, so there's an update. We have been charging here a little bit. We put uh, like a thing here to cover up because outside it's pretty hot. It's uh, 39.5 degrees outside, as you can see. And so this keeps us nice and cool. We're now about halfway charged. And as you can see, the battery temperature went up to 45 degrees Celsius. We're still getting 16 kilowatt, which is not too bad. Um, so yeah, a little update from there and uh, we'll see how it goes from there. So we have a quick update. We are still charging. Uh, temperature outside has gone up. As you can see, we're nearly at 40 degrees Celsius right now. Car says it needs two more hours to fully charge and we're a little bit over half battery. And as you can see, the battery is at a temperature of 46 degrees Celsius um, up here. You can see that. and. Um, yeah, as you can see, it's been climbing and now it's like kind of leveling off and the charging speed, as you can see here, it was at 26 uh, kilowatt and it's been slowly going down and now we're at yeah about 12 kilowatt. Um, so yeah, this is now really thermal throttling here. We have some battery gate issue kind of. Yeah, it really shouldn't be this slow um, at this uh, state of charge, but um, that's how it is because it's hot outside and also because mainly because the battery is so hot. So I really have the feeling that Volkswagen doesn't want um, the battery to go about higher than this 46 degrees Celsius. And so it's gonna try to keep it here. And in order to do that, it's just gonna reduce the charging speed. So we have another little update. We have made it uh, to France, Ionity right here. Um, after having driven quite a bit already. Um, right now time is 18.12. Uh, yeah, so we've been driving for nearly nine hours in total or on the road and uh, let's see what the car says inside. Uh, we are charging with a relatively slow speed 
uh, I don't know if you can see it there. But if we look inside here, uh, the battery is nice and toasty right now at 47 degrees Celsius, as you can see. Um, and so that's why we're getting really, really slow charging speed of uh, about 13 and a half, 14 um, kilowatts. And as you can see, the battery is, yeah, really pretty empty. It's even telling me full charge is three hours and 15 minutes, which is a very, very long time. So um, yes, we're gonna be here for quite a while. All right, all right. So we have made it after a long, long journey, 650 kilometers driven. Time is now nearly 10 p.m. and we started about at nine. Um, yeah, what a long journey. And we're charging now, last stop before Zurich. And uh, now we're gonna take a look here what the board computer has to say. So the temperature of the battery is, as you can see on the top here, 46.9 degrees Celsius and we're charging at uh, about 14 kilowatt as you can see battery is nearly empty <laughs> selling us three hours and 40 minutes until fully charged outside air temperature is 26 degrees and what was really interesting while I was driving um, it actually reached a top uh, high temperature of 50 degrees Celsius as you can see right here that was the hottest it has been um, and that was actually while driving and then uh, while driving it actually cooled down a little bit uh so about like yeah three degrees cooler um just i guess from driving in the wind and we always drove at 100 kilometers an hour so yeah there we go we did it and um as you can see it's possible to drive with uh, the volkswagen e-up for quite a long journey but it's gonna take some time and especially yeah good to know that at about 45 degrees Celsius um, that's where the battery really starts to throttle a lot and at the last charging stop actually I was um, I got a charging speed even when I was like half full charged because it was so hot of only mm, six kilowatts and so that is really definitely slow that's why I decided to just keep going and uh, hope that the battery cools down a little bit and yeah so it, it has cooled down a little bit and so Thanks to that, we can charge a little bit faster. It's crazy what like uh, three degrees, four degrees can make. It uh, just doubles the, the charging speed. All right, so this is it. And um, I wish you a good night all.